right. What's up, everybody? Today we're playing Odd Death Rattle Demon Hunter. So the idea behind this deck was to really take advantage of some of the new cards, namely Tusk Piercer and Death Speaker Blackthorn. So the biggest issue I had with this deck uh, when trying to build it was that there are not enough or any aggressive death rattles, uh, you know, that cost three or five mana. It was just really, really hard to find any of them. And so the way that we built this deck was that I took it a little bit of a meme direction to start off with, with Fugan and Stalag. We're running the new Burning Blade Acolyte, a five mana 1-1 one, one death rattle, summon a 5-8 with taunt. And then of course we're running the birds to turn off the arena decks. So when I initially played this, I thought this was going to be a meme. I didn't think this deck was going to be pretty good. And then the next thing you knew, I was rattling off an 8-3 and three record with the deck. So it seemed pretty strong. And it can only get better once we have better death rattles to put into our deck than Burning Blade, Acolyte, and Fugan and Stalag. No offense to Fugan and Stalag, they're just not at the top, you know, of the competitive level when it comes to wild. The last thing that I want to talk about is Lorekeeper Polkelt. So you might be saying, why put Lorekeeper Polkelt in your deck? You're just going to draw Baku. And yeah, you're right. But we're also going to draw Death Speaker Blackthorn on turn 7. Death Speaker Blackthorn on turn 7 is kind of busted. Polkelt on 5, draw the Baku on 6, draw the Blackthorn on 7, play the Blackthorn on 7, win the game. Because you spit out like 20-20 worth of stats, and then your, if your opponent tries to clear the board, you're summoning an 11-11 off of Fugan or Stalag, or you're summoning a 5-8 with Taunt. Vectus is another card that I included in this deck, uh, and it has actually performed really, really well. It's kind of like a turn 8 play post-Blackthorn. I will say the normal way you play this game is you just play like a normal odd demon hunter in the early game with your one drops. You just try to be aggressive, try to get your opponent to use the resources, use some of their AoE early in the game. And then you, you know, slam down a Death Speaker Blackthorn, your opponent's like, okay, what the hell? Uh, my opponent just played 2021 of the stats and I have no more AoE to deal with the board. Uh, this deck actually performed really, really well and I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys enjoy the content, make sure you guys check out the live stream, twitch.tv slash get me out. And make sure you guys join the Discord for more lists like this. You can find the link to that down in the description below. And of course, if you like this content, make sure you guys drop a subscription here on YouTube so you guys know when future videos go live. With all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. <laughs> I never drew battle card in three games and then deleted the deck. Oh my god. Not like this, chat. Alright, we drew the pole kelt. Nice, 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 nice. Are we 10 star gaming? You know it, dude. You know it. One day, I'll be a real knight. <laughs> Baku Tutor? Yup. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do this actually. The taunt synergies aren't even that good. Well, like, what if we, like. Run Strong Shell in that deck instead of like Arbor Up. I don't even know if there is an Arbor Up in that deck. Hmm. I cannot wait to read these. Time to revisit it. Chad, am I toxic for silencing this Libra Paladin? Yep. Do I care? Nope. Have I played Librams yet? I have not. That's why it was on the list uh, or the poll. And yes, you guys, your eyes are not deceiving you. We are running Fugit and Stalag in a deck on purpose. Okay. Hey, I got you, friends. I don't even think I'm gonna get to the freaking Blackthorn with how much we're just punching face. Ubi Pack MTG, thank you so much for that tier one sub. Appreciate that. I didn't join the content. Appreciate the support. You now have access to the best team on Twitch. Use them wisely, friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The battle is over. You win. Damn, dude, we didn't even get to do the broken things. We just did our demon hunter things. <laughs> have I done Agra Shadow Priest? I have. It was not the hottest. 
I have played it though, so if you would like a list, there's a list in my Discord, I believe. Uh, do you think when you draw or swing draw a card, poison fits into Cutlass? Yes, and I think that's the only rogue deck that it does fit into. <laughs> but yes, I do think it fits in that deck. I love the idea of Rally Icky Priest. I do too. Turns out it wasn't that great, but it was actually a ton of fun. It was actually very good against Dark Lair. And kind of like key blocks in general. So. Hmm. I think this indicates that they're gonna like breath. So I'm not gonna commit any one drops here. No reason to me to commit more here. That just gets cleaned up. When you Q, do you against, go against people at your MMR or your rank? Your MMR. With the new system that they did. It's so like I am plat 5, but I am... Oh, they top deck the breath. Wait. Is there maybe a second breath in hand then? Because they made this play. Like they had a breath in hand. It's probably a second one here. Oh, with the, yeah, with the new system, it's um, based upon people that you remember. Yes. Also, paper towel, never feel bad for asking questions. It's okay, that's why I'm here. <laughs> you don't have to feel bad for like having to ask. Ah, uh, no science daddy, nah. It, it's it's literally all MMR based. What's up, Assassin? How's it going, dude? Fugan plus zero power? Yeah, exactly. Like, I'm queuing into a bunch of people that were like 10x, right? So, like, legend players. Even though I'm plat 5. And they might be, le um, like,. It, in legend, or they might just be like climbing themselves. So, Guide my hand. like, my, I think my first game of the season, like one of my first games of the season, was against Martian, who was about to hit legend. <laughs> Wait, why is it showing basic card back when you have these? Has it always done that? Wait, hello? Do you guys see this? Basic card back? What? That was weird. Okay, the fact that this is Reno Priest and they played the Breath off the top, the Penance on the 2-4 is, like, even more questionable now. <laughs> Bug number 56,547? Uh, yep. <laughs> uh, it's the same cards that it's always showed you. They have locked Zephyrus' pool. Their deck is Legend card back? Oh, it is. And, wait, my card back. <laughs> All right. Even more bugs. Feels weird, man. If someone told me Meowth would play Fugan into Hero Power on 6 on in Odd Demon Hunter a few months ago, I would not believe him. To be completely honest with you, neither would I. So. Alright. Let's, uh, slow it down a little bit. Try to see if we can bait out a, uh, Psychic Scream. Before I play the Death Speaker. <laughs> Thanks for watching, Poo 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 Dum Dum. Appreciate you. Yes, but how? But how? No, there's a scream. Exactly what we wanted to see. Dumb 
Double bird is nice, right? Easy. It's a little bit annoying that we didn't hit the fugue in here <laughs> with the stall egg in my hand, but it's okay. Wait, this doesn't even... Hmm. <laughs> I only have one death rattle. It was the one bird. <laughs> uh, it'll be fine. It's a refill, chat. Refill. This almost feels like a real deck. I mean, this card is just so dumb, dude. This card is actually, on its own, so broken. Problem is, like, you're having to pull Fugans and Stalags and 1-1s one out of your deck. Which is not sick. <laughs> but... Are you, good, are you hitting that line? Have a good night, dude. Thanks for tuning in. And having to draw Baku. Well, I mean... Drawing the Baku is okay if I always get to play this on 7, you know? Did you actually draw the Stereo? God. I hate playing against Priest, man. I actually hate it so much. <laughs> like, even though this ended up okay for me, I still hate playing against Priest. I hate it so much. Alright, I have six in my hand. I need four more damage. Uh, Illidari Studies can get us damage. I mean, also, they played Mass Hysteria, Regular Hysteria, and Psychic Scream. So unless they generate another AoE here, I might also just be able to kill them. So... That was not removal. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. You get to see us attempt memes live. <laughs> like Fugan and Stalag Odd Demon Hunter. That's actually not bad. <laughs> it's actually pretty good. Jinxie, thank you so much for the five gifted subs as well. You're insane. Thank you. So much generosity today. <laughs> thank you for the five gifted. Uh, Nexus, Odd Dragon, Stupid Fun Tim, No Tofu for you. Wait, why no tofu for me? Wait, sad. And Radical Mino, welcome guys. Make sure you guys thank Jinxie for your amazing emotes. And Jinxie, thank you so much for the support. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. I cannot do that. This deck is exciting. I actually am very surprised that it's like holding its own. We're two and one with the deck, which is like genuinely kind of surprising. Oh, I'm not gonna play this. I'm gonna play another two health minion here. Play around Defile. A little bit. I mean, we keep drawing our Polk out, by the way, which is <laughs> kind of insane. Because that means we keep getting to Death Speaker on 7. So. All right. If I don't trade, my opponent can like hit here and then defile. I mean, they can do that anyways. They could also just like trade here. One drop defile full clears. It's also like three damage. Hmm. I I'm playing for the death speaker anyways, right? That's fine. 
Have I tried Murloc Shaman with any cards yet? I have. It was like the very first deck I played. I have a video up on YouTube if you want to check that out. I also have the deck code in Discord. So if you're ever interested in lists, I highly recommend you guys check out the Discord because that's where I post all of my decks. Uh, they have the, the one cost, so I'm glad I traded because it at least protects this Battle Fiend. Did we get rid of the Void Caller or the Plague? I think I get rid of the Void Caller. I don't really think I mind the Plague, right? Because I'm ideally pulling minions that... It, two daddies? Yeah. Like... I don't think the plague is that big of a deal when I have a bunch of like 1 1s and stuff. Is this the Death Rattle Demon Hunter everyone's talking about? Uh, I do not know what deck the people are talking about, but this is Death Rattle Demon Hunter. It's actually not bad. I was just facing a Dark Lair, they went all in on me with a new Legendary Warlock minion that gets Shadow Spells. I forgot I had Ice Block, XD. Uh, will I be making a meta deck list YouTube video? Um, I mean, it's way too early for me to know, like, what the meta lists are, right? But, potentially, yeah. At least I can't zero mana tap into cooldown, that's fair. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe, yeah, that's the one that we lost. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, you just, like, retilted me. GG. GG. I don't even need the Death Speaker. And it's three and one. It's not bad. None will survive. Running Intrepid instead of Undertaker? Well, like, Undertaker's not that good in our deck, right? Because all of our Death Rattles are 3 and 5 costs, so you're never really snowballing the Undertaker. Alright, well, I'm never attacking with that. <laughs> I am not drawing you cards. No, not today. Three damage is not worth giving this deck a uh, draw. I have to give him a card here. Oh, that's so annoying. Mm. It might have also just been like correct for me to let them the watch post live and take the uh, crab rider out here. If they have second call to arms, we probably are going to lose. They should just, yeah, swing face.
Uh, this is bad order. I should have killed this first, just in case it played like Plague of Flames or something. Oh, hi. Oh. Calculated. <laughs> My order here is all sorts of messed up now, but whatever. <laughs> all right. I just need if I can get to seven, I think we'll be okay, without being like super far behind on board. Hmm. Aren't you supposed to swing first in case so you don't draw a secret? So the secrets in this deck are Never Surrender, Oh My Yog, and like Repentance. So I probably just go ahead and hit here. Yep. And I'm just gonna play a 6-6. Six, six. Cause they're not gonna trade into the 1-1 one, one here. So I'll just play a 6-6 six, six here, it'll be fine. And then we play the Blackthorn and we'll be fine. I remember seeing a YouTube video, Warlock at Oh My Og, and they cast Wildfire, so they're here power to through their phase. Yeah, <laughs> that is how it works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of dumb. Oh My Og is a very dumb card. All right, we can just, I think we can all can agree on that. Oh My Og is very dumb. Dude, do I have to not Blackthorn this turn? Nah, dude. Like, I, I will take the 8 here, I think. Oh, they trade. Even better. Never mind. I was just... Like, if they just left that... I was in a really awkward spot. But now that they traded, I just slammed the Blackthorn. Oh, wait. This draw was awful. Now I only... <laughs> Nice draw! Oh no! <laughs> God damn it! I only drew two! I mean, it's the best two in my deck, but come on. That draw was super unlucky? Yeah. It's okay though. Alright, so basically from this point, we just like, don't cast spells. So that, like, oh my yog doesn't screw me over. Yeah? Sound like a plan? The I think the biggest issue right now with, like, all these Death Rattle Synergy decks... GG's, by the way. Nice. Priest has the three mana one. And I really wish that was, like, a neutral card so that I could play it in, like, every deck. But... Backstreet Leper, that's not a good... Okay, lack of good aggressive death battles. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Fixed. I love me as aggressive typing. It's not even aggressive typing. It's just like I have a mechanical keyboard, and it's like right here in front of my mic. So you guys, it sounds super loud. They made an aggressive death battle, but it's four mana. Yeah, they did. I remember that now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The uh, four mana five seven or whatever it is. I just need them to, like, if they print more, then we're in, like, a good spot when it comes to, like, Hunter and Demon Hunter. I hope they bring Arata back to the shop. Wait, you, you think the cool cool thrust skins? I think the uh the one you get at the end of the the battle pass, like the fully upgraded one, I think that one looks pretty sick. Oh, giving me cards. Thank you. Oh, please don't be flame ward. <laughs> uh that's flame ward, isn't it? Oh, it's not Flame Ward. Okay, sweet. Oh, uh, 
Uh, I probably should have drawn first. I just kind of assumed that this was dying. Because if I drew into Twin Slice, we would have had lethal. But, oops. I guess I give him one extra turn, potentially. I mean, it's not like guaranteed I drew Twin Slice, but... Yeah, we wouldn't have drawn since this. You know what's funny? We'll probably lose here. <laughs> it's kind of insane, no? Alright, so the idea here is get the birds down, um, so that, like, if they're popping off with, like, arcane missiles or whatever, they have the chance to draw out the birds instead of other spells, but, I mean, we'll see. Is this Mizaki Mage? I mean, with Colette Oracles and Thalnos, like, I don't know. Where's my big butt? Alright! In case they play, um... Like, Frost Nova and then Ice Lance my face, I have to leave a board slot open here so that I can Demon Companion. Alright, well, they've only drawn 18. Let's see. It looks like they don't have Mazaki. Uh, 